today on Growing Crazy with Jeanette. We're just going to check in on everybody, maybe introduce you if you've forgotten names. And we're just going to say hello and see how everyone is growing. So here we go. Hello, welcome to another episode of Growing Crazy with Jeanette. I'm Jeanette, and I'm crazy, or at least so they say. Anyway, I just uh, thought that we would check in and see how everyone's doing. Everyone's got growth or, you know, so let's see what's going on. Here we go. So first of all, this poinsettia is still got flowers. It's amazing that the fact that it has any petals left on it that are colored is what's amazing. I guess you can keep them alive, but they don't stay colored. So that's my challenge. We'll see what happens. Josephine is doing well. Her new growth is, is doing just fine. The shamrock down here is not doing much. Nothing yet, nothing quite yet. Neither from the acorns either. That's all right though. When acorns start coming up outside, then I'll know that these are due. Eve. I thought I got all of the shamrocks of my dad's out of this plant that I named General Casement, but it seems that I had left one behind. I didn't realize that, but like I said before, the spider plants, they just, the roots take over, so they smother anything that's with them. I didn't know that at the time when I planted the shamrocks, but you live and learn. Anyway, we have one left, one straggler. Cool. And then we've got Suki. And we've got Esme, and check it out. Esme decided that she's going to bloom. I have brand new flowers coming up. That's great. Yay! You never have to fertilize them. That's the one thing about peace lilies I found amazing. If you do, then their flowers turn green. And this is O.C. And of course we've got Odysseus. Looking wonderful in all his glory. That is one big plant. Every time I really look at it, it's impressive to me. I've got a baby growing in here. You look right. Down there. There's a baby. And this has three sides. Like we've seen before. Crazy. Oscar is doing well in his peat moss and perlite mixture. Elephalet does not have anything yet. No growth on the spores. I'm not expecting that for months and months yet. Whisper is doing well. She has new growth everywhere you see light green. Like every single branch. She has new leaves. I like Jade. They look cute and they're easy. And I've got Iggy, the aloe vera. Then I've got these guys, Jinju and Lilu, the air plants. Una, the begonia, angel wing begonia. These are my uh, <clears throat> my Persian white violets. This one's named Echo. And Echo has all kinds of new leaves coming out. That's great. I had no idea I could even grow violet because they never liked me before. That's okay though, I'll take it. I must be doing something right. 
then this uh, ficus back here is doing pretty well too. But when I bought him, he looked fantastic, so that's not surprising. I just have to keep him that way. And then this one I did make fantastic. It was my friend's, and it uh, needed to be made so that it would grow thicker. So I had to thin it out and cut it off some, but it worked. I might make it a little bit thicker. Just a little bit. I like the raised roots so much. I have to look at them every single time. And I love this little asparagus fern. If you look, you can see there's a brand new branch coming out. And that's what they look like. Like that. Aja. Such a different looking plant. It almost looks like a bonsai, but it's a pepperonium. So it's just a plant. It's not actually a bonsai tree or any kind of tree. Yet it has these stocky, woody kind of branches. Like the base of them, the trunks are all wood, just like a tree. Anyway, I can't seem to find what this is. So if anybody knows, let me know. They, they must have been wrong about saying it was pepperonium at the greenhouse because it doesn't look like this. It has the green, the green, green bean looking things go all the way up and down. So these are sparse considering they just have them on the ends. Anyway, that's interesting. Everybody's doing well. Leona is happy. So is Loki. And then we've got Kaya and Seji back there. Kaya is so cool looking. I love this plant. Square leaves. Who would have thought that you'd see something like that in, in nature? Then my little pre-bonsai, baby bonsai, Jade is growing its new leaves, so that one took. I'm so happy. Guess I did brood it successfully. That's great. And then these are the 17-year-old Dickie Tim shamrocks of my dad's from his funeral, and I transplanted the rhizomes, and now they are growing. I have one little baby that just came out yesterday, so that's really cool. Right now, they close their petals because they go to sleep for the night. So I think that's really neat. Leaves, not petals. Same difference with the shamrock. Well, that's about it. So, you know, it's nice seeing you and we're just laid back and chilling. Just showing you how everyone is doing and saying hello. So you don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell your friends about me and I'll be around. Love ya. Bye.